Oh, hello everybody, welcome back to Burke Church. Man, it's a beautiful day out here. I hope everybody else's day is as pretty as this one is. Look at that beautiful sunshine. It seems like it's been raining, or ice, or cold weather for a long time now. So I'm so happy to see a beautiful day. I ain't doing a whole lot here today, just kind of giving a little bit of an update. You know, I ask y'all, for five minutes of watch time. Well, I'd like to say that I thank y'all for giving me the five minutes. It seems like it has really helped with the YouTube algorithm. Today, I just want to bring something to your attention to see if y'all have noticed this or if it's just something local here. I've got some receipts here. Before I go through these receipts, I'm gonna give y'all an update on some of our seeds that we've started. So these cabbage here is our Dollar Tree Survival Garden. And they're doing real good. They're all putting on their extra leaves. They're just about ready to be taken out of here and put into cups. They were the early golden acre cabbage. We started these on 117. So I just wanted to give you an update on our Dollar Tree Survival Garden. And I got one more thing, and then we'll get to the receipts. These is one of the things of our chitted onions, and they're doing real good. I think they're almost ready for me to maybe trim the tops on them just a little bit. If anybody out there knows, do I need to trim these tops or just let them grow? If you would, put it in the comments. I've probably got another month and a half before I can put these into the soil outside. I would say they're roughly five inches tall. So if anybody can give me some advice on these, I would sure appreciate it. So I told you there was some change coming here to Burnt Church and I'm trying to make some shorter videos. Now I am still gonna have some 10 minute videos and things, but I'm trying to cut them down to five or six minutes. I've just been getting them too long. But anyway, what I was wanting to talk about is me and my wife go out to eat some on Saturday mornings. Not every Saturday, but sometimes we will. And we'll go to the Huddle House here in town. And I, I always cut the coupon out of the cooler and take it with us. Man, you about got to now. This morning, I had, let's see, what was it I had? I had the Smokehouse Platter. And without the coupon, the smokehouse platter was $11.99 without the coupon. With the coupon, I had to pay $7.59. So that saved about four and a half dollars, something like that, just doing the math in my head. But how much do you think a cup of coffee is? We drink coffee. I'm used to a cup of coffee at a fast food place being pretty cheap. Not anymore. A cup of coffee is $2.59 for one cup of coffee. Now I think they keep refilling it for free, but it's $2.59. What happened to the 50 cents cup days? Or the free coffee with your meal? But that's that's not still not what I'm wanting to talk about. When you go out to eat, you kind of know you're going to pay more for things. So we take advantage with those coupons and carry them with us. But there's, they've added something on these receipts. And I was wanting to see if y'all have seen this in y'all's area. Of course, you've got the subtotal. Our subtotal for our food was $19.64. Of course, you know taxes is going to be added to the subtotal. I'm used to seeing taxes on the receipt. The taxes on our meal was $1.99. But now they've added one more thing. This is the one thing I'm wanting to see if y'all are seeing this. They've added a supply chain adjustment. And on this receipt, the supply chain adjustment was 72 cents added on to our bill. So we had a supply chain adjustment of 72 cents added onto our meal. Now this is 2-4-2023 is when this receipt was. 
The first receipt that I noticed this on was on 1-22-2023. And me and my wife and grandson went and ate. And this was the first time that we noticed the supply chain adjustment. And on this receipt, it was a dollar and a nickel. I don't know if it was because we ate more food because we had a grandson with us or what. But I was just wanting to throw this out there to y'all. If you would, check your receipts. See if y'all are getting a supply chain adjustment on y'all's receipts. But that's about all I have for you today. I'm going to get out here in this pretty sunshine and I may even go fishing today. If I'll get to it or not. I've got a lot of work I need to do. But I thank y'all for watching and I pray God blesses you and I will see you in the next one.